The interruption of blood flow in crucial organs like the heart and brain can lead to sudden death. This is the leading cause of mortality in modern society, of which in the US alone, one person dies every 30 seconds. The circulatory system is a very complicated maze of vessels, from the heart to the rest of the body, carrying blood with its oxygen and nutrients. The blood flow follows the rules of fluid dynamics, which is influenced to a great extent by its individual components and the geometry of the blood vessels. It is this complex fluid motion that ultimately determines when and how heart disease such as atherosclerosis, develops, leading to a blockage of the flow in the artery. Predicting or preventing these occurrences is at present impossible. The only means of determining more detailed information on flow interruptions is by applying computational methods to model blood flow in the arteries. Computational scientists at the INRC EPFL, Harvard University, and doctors from Harvard Medical School have put together a model that captures blood flow in real heart arteries of specific patients. For the first time, specialists are given an unprecedented detailed view especially near critical points like artery bifurcation, where arterial disease is more prevalent. A structure of particular beauty and significance to the overall flow pattern is the rouleau. Here, a group of red blood cells stack on top of each other, then move apart and come back together, very much like dance partners. At present, this type of simulation can only be performed on the biggest supercomputers, like the IBM BGP. Computational scientists aim to move their tools working on more affordable machines, like GPGPU clusters. The dream of this project is to put computational tools in the hands of doctors, who can use them to diagnose and predict the risk of heart attack enabling computer-guided medicine to help people live longer lives.